I haven't been able to get my birth certificate or my social security since someone stole my pocketbook three years ago. Every time I would send the money, I put the, like first it was five dollars. So I sent the five dollars, I think maybe about, I know I sent it at least five times and I never heard from them. Then the next time when I went to get it, it had gone up to ten dollars. And I sent that twice and that was it. I said, the heck with it, I'm not sending my money, I don't get no refund for it. And I never could get those, that birth certificate back until I think it was Nikki, I think her name is Nicole, I call her Nikki, up at the face to face. I went there to get the ID that was not quite three weeks ago and it's here. It came here on my birthday. She sent me a card and said, I tried to get it for your birthday and it was up, it came on my birthday. If the people could vote, then we're not even worried about it, if they could vote, because there's enough people out here to put Obama back in there, he's Democrat. They can put him back in there, but they, he's not going to get back in there if these people can't vote, you can believe that. He, he's not going to get in there. He definitely isn't, because it's, it's too many black people that don't have no ID at all. They were just like me, they didn't have any ID. They don't have any. It's, it's just, it's crazy, but they just don't have them. And like I said, when the parents died, they never thought that they would need it, I guess. And so they didn't, didn't follow it up because I didn't. I didn't even think about no, I went and did everything I wanted to do. They didn't have to ask me but no ID. Then all of a sudden here come all this ID mess. Everything is ID, ID. If you don't have this state ID, you can't get a crack out in the street. And it's, it's really, it's, it's, to me it's silly. I don't know, I can't see it. I really can't see it. What is this? Oh, that's a piece off a page, a picture. Oh, uh, I told you that sometime already.